The control unit has the following parts. Display section, candidate set section, result section, ballot section, rear compartment. The display section consists of on, green lamp, busy, red lamp, and a display panel which consists of 24 red colored 17 segment alphanumeric characters in two equal rows. When the power switch in the rear door compartment is pushed upwards to the on position, the lamp glows green to indicate that the EVM is ready for use. If no button is operated for 10 to 20 minutes, the CU goes to power save mode, indicated by flickering off green on lamp every 5 seconds. The system comes out of this mode with the activation of any button on CU. The unit does not go into power save mode in case of real time clock RTC failure. The busy lamp glows red when the ballot button in the ballot section is pressed. It goes off with a beep sound when the voter casts his vote. Display panel displays the data on two rows of total 24 characters. After pushing the power switch to on position, the following power on display sequence will be seen on the display panel. A display EVM is on and ECI indicates the machine is on and ready to participate in election. A display DTE 01-02-07 and TME 08-36-50 indicates date is in date month year and time is in hour minute second format a display sl number dash h00003 indicates the serial number of the machine a display candidates and 10 indicates that the contesting candidates are 10 a display battery and high indicates the status of the battery or power pack is high. Various types of display which appear on display panel are as follows. Invalid indicates a button on the control unit has been pressed out of sequence. End indicates the end of display sequence after pressing the result or clear buttons. Full indicates the maximum number of votes for which the machine is designed have been polled. The machine is designed to store 2000 votes in its memory. Printing indicates the printing is to be executed. Change battery indicates for change of power pack as battery status reached for replacement. Let us now see the various types of error displays that appear on display panel. Link error 1 indicates link error of first BU. That is, interconnecting cable is missing, snapped, or when only one ballot unit is used, slide switch in that unit has not been set at position 1, or when more than one ballot units are used, those units have not been linked in proper order. Pressed error 1 indicates any one of the candidates button in the first ballot unit is kept pressed or jammed. Error indicates the control unit is not fit for use. Clock error indicates the malfunction of real-time clock RTC. CU error indicates the control unit is to be changed. BU1 error indicates the ballot unit 1 is to be changed. The candidate set section cover can be opened by pressing the latch on the left hand side. This houses 
a power pack compartment and a candidate set button compartment. The power pack compartment is on the left hand side of the candidate set section and is for fixing the power pack. The candidate set button compartment is located at the right hand side and covered with flap which opens from left to right and can be sealed by thread seal. In this compartment a black candidate set button is located. This candidate set section can be closed and sealed by thread seal. The result section has an elliptical aperture on the left hand side through which the close button is visible. This section can be opened by pressing the latch on the left hand side and opening its cover. The right portion actually has an inner compartment with its own door. The door of the inner compartment has two elliptical apertures through which buttons mark result and print are seen. The inner door can be opened by inserting the thumb and a finger through the two apertures above the result and print buttons and then pressing the inner latches simultaneously inwards and pulling the cover up. On opening the door a frame will be seen in the inner side of the door around the two apertures for fixing the green paper seal. In this compartment there are three buttons. Two yellow buttons marked result and print and a white clear button. In the ballot section there are two buttons. A blue total button and a large blue ballot button and a buzzer. The rear side portion of the control unit has also a compartment with a cover. This cover is hinged in the bottom and opens swinging downwards when the latch in the middle is pressed downwards. The interconnecting cable from the ballot unit can be connected to the connector on the left hand side signed BU connector. A power switch is provided in the middle for switching the unit on or off and a 9 pin female plug on right hand side for data interface DI connection.